today AI isn't this kind of like alien individual that is thinking for itself and doing a lot of things that that we're seeing in the movies like Terminator or anything like that, right? It's more a algorithm that's taking a lot of our information from the internet and it's using and repurposing that information to make assumptions, to make probabilistic estimates around data and other information. And we're starting to see a lot of this come to light, especially with ChatGPT and uh, now Google's uh, learning models and uh, it's it's starting to become more evident how valuable this is to humanity. People aren't sure just how many jobs this could take over, if their livelihood could be affected. What are some of the key industries that we could see AI replacing these positions? When we think about what AI can do today, uh, a lot of it is at the um, more level of, you know, white collar jobs and white collar work. And so we're seeing uh, AI taking the role of much design work, whether it be language or um, imagery or even videography, um, all these things are starting to become very easy for AI to do. Taking more of the um, summarization, so now you can start to batch summarize large swaths of text and who would want to do that? Researchers, but publishers, um, even teachers, professors. And so it's really something that uh, it, it takes more of the base form of a lot of these jobs and it enables people to elevate their efforts to more of the creative elements that only humans have, right? And more of the personal interactions. Obviously, you're eliminating a lot of these salaries for people, replacing them with AI how much is this going to save a company we can see with like the largest tech companies today um you're seeing jobs anywhere from uh let's say five percent to twelve percent of workforces at google microsoft amazon um they're just they're they're being written off because a lot of the um, base work whether it be base level coding or entry level uh you know whether it be data entry or some of just the general thought processes around um, some of the more entry-level job uh, opportunities at those organizations, uh, they can be done by AI. Um, whether it be marketing, media, um, all these things, it, AI enables you to um, get a lot more uh, efficiency in your processes. What could we expect the jobs market to look like as this advances? Yeah, I think that there's going to be, let's say, 10% of the jobs on the workforce totally wiped out. But keep in mind that you're going to add back in um, maybe 12% more jobs, right? Because now there are new ways to do business, new ways and new businesses that can be um, created and more uh, opportunity for entrepreneurs and more opportunity for, um, you know, single to, let's say, uh, five person teams that can now create and scale a large startup or a large enterprise. And so there's more opportunity for that, just like uh, in the early 2000s, the internet gave so many opportunities, but also took away some of, you know, uh, the majority of old jobs.